Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Plays Final Fantasy IX. Today we gotta find the rest of the Pluto Knights. Now if you look at this list, you can see Steiner's listed as one of them, so there's eight total knights for him to find, but we already found two of them in the guardhouse, so we need to find six other knights, and they're scattered all throughout this castle, and we're gonna find them today. Also a quick correction from last episode, I said Steiner's name, his first name was Albert. It's actually Adalbert, which is a little bit different, I don't know why I said Albert. It was like, it, for some reason that just popped in my mind. Anyways, there's no knights out here. I figured I'd just show this little scene. This is where we had the sword play little mini game last time. Oh my God. Look at that woman. Steiner's like looking directly at her. What is she doing? Oh, we need to call like a medic for her. Man, the, those movie backgrounds are a classic. All right, so there is a Knight of Pluto here that we need to find. I think we need to go this way. All right, then we need to back up a little bit. And... Ah, got him. All right. Yes, sir, I'm looking, sir. Yeah, you, you do that. If you don't wait till he's around this corner, as soon as you get around this bend, he will turn around and run straight back and watch. Hey, buddy, how's it going? I want to talk to you. I got to... No? Oh, all right, sure. Yeah, some soldier. He runs away from his captain. Uh, there's actually... I don't think there's anything over on this side. Uh, maybe a hidden scene, I guess. It's not really a scene, but I'll show it anyways. So many dishes. You don't say. I do miss... I, I miss this generation of gaming, to be quite honest. The PlayStation era. Oh, is it not over here? Oh, actually, it's on the other side. All right. And here we get to meet this strange person. Now's the time to show your skills, boys. That's not creepy at all. I don't know what kind of Eggmeister? Fried to perfection. Ovenmeister. Oh, they all have little names. I did not know that. Huh. Interesting. There's, there's nothing there, but those little guys are creepy, aren't they? I like their chef hats. Okay, let's head over to this side. Um, there's nothing we can do down. Oh, no, we got to go down in a minute. But, uh, the other area where the guardhouse was, there's nothing else there. Hello. Mulkenheim? Mulkenheim? Oh, I'm so hungry. Wimps like you are the reason nobody relies on men in Alexandria. Bite the bullet, you worthless grub. Whatever, Captain. I'm so hungry. You should be fired. But, you know, eating something does sound pretty good right about now. Try some, sure. Mmm. Mmm. Alexandrian cooking is the finest in the realm. What a hypocrite. Uh, do you say anything now that I ate in front of you? No? Aw, oh, man. Anyways, you just need to talk to this guy, and now he's officially looking for the princess. Yeah, it doesn't really state that he's going to leave and go look for her, but he is. Now, in here, I believe this is the library. And we have a knight back here. Hello. You see, I never wanted to be in the military. I just wanted to write fantasy novels. Captain, please, let me quit the Knights of Pluto. No. Nitwit, you just joined. Now, go find the princess soldier. Wah. <laughs> You guys say anything interesting? Uh, what was that? I wonder how the Princess Royal's tutor, Dr. Tot, is doing. Huh, I actually did not know they mentioned that here. The little background information here and there. This, uh, we're on Gaia. That's the name of the planet we're on. And I believe you have... Dude, come here. The Princess, no, she hasn't visited today. Oh, which one was it? Is it in the other room? Ah, uh, maybe. All right, and before we go too far, we need to go back in here because the future fanfic writer is hiding. Eh? No, where is he? Where are you? There's somewhere in here. Are you up here? There you are. Oh, you found me. Yeah, go look for the princess, you slacker. I could have sworn he was in the second one. Ah, well. Oh, it's you. You guys are the ones that I was thinking of. You! Her Majesty ordered some texts about Adolans, but we got a lot of books here, you know. Adolans. Now, uh, that's the term for summons in this game. 
It's like, they're the same thing as Espers. They're just called the Dolans. I believe they were called the Dolans. No, they were called... Were they called Espers or Dolans in Final Fantasy V? I don't know. They were called the Dolans in Final Fantasy IV, though, weren't they? Actually, they were called Mist Monsters, or Phantom is in the original one. The play seems to be a hit. But if we fail to find the princess before the curtain falls, her majesty will be most displeased. And we will be the laughing stocks of Beatrice and her retinue. I must hurry. Sure. Is there anything interesting? No sign of the princess? Eh, yeah, well. Good job, guards. How could you actually... Oh, you know what? Never mind. Hey, buddy. You need to go look for the princess. Oh, nobody's come this way? Oh, you're a good soldier. Your, your skin patches seem really familiar. I don't know what it is. Put... Can't put my finger on it. Hey, you. Sitting here watching the water always brings peace to my soul. Care to have a seat, Captain? Now is not the time. By order of Her Majesty, we must go search for Princess Garnet. What? This calls for immediate action. Fair Princess, be not afraid. Hagen is on the trail. That's Hagen? Hagen? Uhagen? Ah, you know, man. Are you Steiner of the Pluto Knights? In order, sir, I'm a new recruit here. Oh, don't worry. You'll think very low of me soon enough. That seems to be the trend, anyways. You! Waymer? Hey, let's go to Trino. Just the two of us. Hmm. Let me think about it. You there! Stop that immediately! Go search for Princess Garnet! Yes, sir, at once, sir. Why was you got pointy boobs, lady? How, Jesus Christ! I'm never. Are you all right? Oh my God! You can poke an eye out with those things. That's gee, yeah. I lost my train of thought there. That should be uh, all the Pluto Knights that we have to find. Uh, if we well, okay, there's one more, but if we find all of them, we do get a special item, and the last one should be right up here. There you are. <laughs> Break. Uh, you know what? You're Mr. Nope right now. I'm so tired. Oh. Captain Sonnet, do you climb this tower for exercise too? No, no, no. I'm searching for Princess Garnet. Is the princess at the top of this tower or not? I want to reach the top, but at my age, I get so short of breath. Excuse me, you have something to give me. By the way, Captain, have all have we all received the order? Of course, all knights will obey. Obey. Hmm, was there an extra one? Ah, so you've given orders to the double super sleuths, Blutzen and Cole. Cole? Mm. And also... Ah, so you've given to, uh, orders to our most ins inspirational writer, Lado. I'm going to butcher these names. Anyways, the information he's giving you here is information that you're going to need much, 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 much later in the game. Just, I mean, you could write it down now, but chances are you'll probably, like, forget where you put those notes in the future. I will remind you when the time is, you know, time has arrived for this information. Uh, but just keep in mind if you really want to know what we're going to be doing with this information in the future. Well, finding all of them, we get an elixir, which I won't use for quite a while. All right, so he's done for. And actually, that completes our little search and, well, order. <laughs> a lot different than search and rescue, you're right. But search and order is done for the Pluto Knights. Now we just need to come up here and realize how old we really are. Whew. Fatigue raises its ugly head. No, I must persevere. The princess must be found! <laughs> Wait! Over there! It's Princess Garnet! <laughs> I love the tantrum animation. Being hounded by brigands! Fear not, princess! Your knight is coming! She looks so happy. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I love the sparks on his... 
I love the sparks on his armor when he comes off of the of grinding up against the rock. She must be a thrill seeker because she's having a blast. I like Zidane's just like, oh god, I don't want to die. <laughs> Here I come to save the day. Ah! You guys still remember Mighty Mouse? Yeah, probably not. I was getting old when I was a kid. <sighs> Where'd the princess go? <laughs> Ow. The strength of which that princess has is quite astounding to be able to spin people around like that. You can feel my drum reverberating on in your gut, can't you? No, that's weird. Are you an alligator man? I think you're an alligator man. Yeah, that's clearly an alligator man. Hey, Zidane, what are you doing here? Being crushed by a princess? You ever quotes waltz, polka, anything? Uh, yeah, no, actually, I was going to make a joke about a song, but I can't actually think of any. See what I mean? She just runs by them and they spin in circles. Hold your horses there. What kind of cat are you chasing, darling? You should at least say you're sorry. Please pardon me. I was in a hurry, you see. And here I am, fixing to get ready for my big entrance. I don't think they have a south or southern accents in this world. Hi, Zidane. Did you see the way she hit me? This cowgirl's wild in a bucking bronco. Just let me talk to her, Ruby. Come again, partner? Did you hear what I was saying? Hey, Ruby, we'll talk later. Also, put on a proper shirt. What do you say? Anything, say anything else? Who's that damsel? Oh, man, do you? You have to know. Right? Yes, you have to know, because you were in the intro when I did the thing, so you have to know. I would, I would imagine. Phew. Well, it looks like we, like you finally made up your mind. Wow, we really had to improvise, but hey, we got her. Do you, do you work for this theater, theater ship? Oh, well, she figured it out, huh? As you have no doubt suspected. The truth is that I am actually Captain Steiner, I mean Princess Ghana Tilled Alexandros, heir to the throne of Alexandria. I have a favor I wish to ask of you. I wish to be kidnapped right away. That's what they always say, but it's always a setup. Never listen. Never listen. Huh? I don't, I mean. Princess, where are you? Please, they've come for me. They? You mean Steiner? Ah, we can take him. Aha, uh -huh. so that's what's going on. All right, leave them to me. Thank you, you have my gratitude. Already then, your highness. I shall hereby do my best to kidnap you. Because that's not weird at all. What are you two doing? Come on, this way. Don't worry, princess, it's my friend Cinna. Oh, really? I thought it was a monster. I mean, I'm sorry, you startled me. Well, with a face like his, I'd be pretty shocked too. Man, that hurts. I wash up every morning, you know. Princess? This way. I don't really explain why Cinna looks like that. I mean, he's just an ugly dude. But he does have, like, the black mage eyes, doesn't he? All right, we'll follow you. Princess? I love the armor sound. Princess. Princess! Princess? Princess! Dude, there's like one, there's two doors. Choose which one, just choose one. Now you can choose two. Where have you been? Sir, I'm sorry, sir. Princess? Hey, Cinna, this is a dead end. <laughs> I thought this might happen. Open. Says me. So I set up this escape hatch. Come on, jump inside. You got like a... 
Does he have a chain collar on? The person, uh, the princess must be down there. I'll, I'll go first, sir. Man, your knight sucks, Steiner. They can't even jump down a hole correctly. Hey, what do you do think you're doing? Captain, sir, I'm stuck, sir. Grr, blast it. <laughs> he bought it. Oh, good old trusty patches. You know, I would imagine jumping on that engine would have burned the hell out of their feet, even with protection on. Wow, you're really athletic, princess. I think I'm falling for you. This is nothing. I've been training to escape the castle, after all. What a waste. If only you weren't a princess. We have no time for idle banter. Come, let us move on. Yeah, Zidane, I think you're striking off a little bit. Also, I'm going to keep probably switching up how I say his name, just because... I'm, I'm inconsistent. Anyways, let's go to our menu and equip the Mage Master that we got. It's better in all regards. It teaches the same skill Flee, and it teaches the additional skill Detect. It's just it's stronger, and it teaches the same skill. Uh, I don't think we have really anything else we want to do right now. We could have give, given uh, Zadana the Moonstone, but I uh, put it on Steiner. So uh, we'll worry about that a little bit later. Okay, so some, for more extra treasure in this area, we need to turn the wheel to the left. To the left, to the left. Everything you own is a box to the left. What's the rest of that? In that closet, that's my stuff. If I paid for it, please don't touch. Yeah. Hey, if you reduce the engine's power, we'll crush the ship. Turn the wheel back to the right. To the right, to the right. Everything in the box. No, okay, never mind. Anyways, we need to do this again, but towards the left this time. I mean, to the right this time, uh, just to get another chest to drop. Pretty much the same scene plays out. And, hey, if you rev it up too high, you'll ruin the engine. Turn the wheel back to the left, to the left, to the left. Okay, I'll stop that now, I'm sorry. All right, so that's out of the way. Let's run, you say anything interesting, princess? What should we do now? I don't know. Hide? That'd be, you know, a good move. Anyways, in the first treasure chest, we have a phoenix down. They do the same thing they do in every Final Fantasy, which was they revive a down party member. And in this one, we have a phoenix pinion. Now, that one's a little bit different. It is essentially the same as a phoenix down, but it can't be used outside of combat. You use it, and it's pr it, it's kind of like a single-target Phoenix spell. Yeah, that's about it. Oh, also, if you press Select, if you're using a 360 controller, you can bring up this little handy-dandy help menu. It's pretty good, right? It's useful, anyways. Actually, I think if you press... Yeah, if you pr press Select, you can see uh, where the cursor... The cursor over your character's head is. Let's get this play over with and get the hell out of here. Yeah, you, you know, you're not wrong. We are kind of... Committing treason? Is stealing a princess treason? Or just kidnapping? Huh. Aha! Princess I, Steiner hath come to your rescue. You needn't worry, your highness. Good work. This will be remembered as the Pluto's Knight's finest hour. Which is kind of sad. <laughs> just relax, princess. We'll get you out of here. What? You're not one of my knights. You can, you can jest. Leave the princess to us. All right, if you couldn't tell by the patches on that Pluto Knight, that is our lovely friend. Loading screen, oh, okay. It is our lovely friend, Blank, who has come to our rescue, kind of, really. I mean, we probably could have beat this guy without him, maybe? We stole a lot of the hat. I just want a silk shirt now. Uh, yeah, Leather Hat was the common steel, and the next one is the uncommon steel. He only has two things to worry about. Now, hey, there we go. I did get a comment, like, saying that there's a mod for better FPS in battle, or speeds up the ATB. This game comes built in with a fast-forward feature. So, if I'm getting really, like, tired of the wait, I can hit F1, 
and it speeds everything up a little bit. I'm not probably gonna install the mod. If it gets a little out of hand, like if it's really, really bad after we play for a few hours. <laughs> That's such a cool animation that they, I think they only use that here. I'm not the skill effect, but the armor shatter effect. Um, but yeah, if the ATB is still really annoying as we progress through the game, then I might install the mod, but I don't like modding things like that, that are, uh, it's weird. I don't like changing base features of a game. I don't mind adding stuff, but changing like the core value of a game probably sounds a little bit confusing more, more so than I'm trying to actually explain, but I just don't like changing the mechanics of the game like that. Anyways, now's our chance. Let's come on. Let's come on. That's a little kinky, Kronos. Tonight, I shall finally see my daughter Cornelia be thrown to Prince Rob Schneider. And then Prince Schneider and his kingdom will be mine. <laughs> Your Majesty, we have caught the intruder. What are you guys? You're like little gimp hog clamp dudes. Why, my poor Marcus. Dude totally looks like Miss Piggy from behind. Hark, lad, no matter how much thou dost treasure Cornelia, no matter how deeply she might believe, she doth love thee. Never shall I see her marry a peasant such as thee. When yon bell strike three, under the X you shall be. I sound like a pirate now, I know. Grr, who darned out the lights? Tis a loading screen. What now? We can't go any further. Hmm. Sedan, get on number two. Okay, Princess Garnet, this way. Stop! He even gets one shot at outside of combat. Sina, I feel so bad for you, man. Furthermore. P Princess Garnet. Guys, just improvise. Oh? What's all this? It's called the stage, Steiner. Cornelia. Um. Marcus is Cornelia's lover. Oh, Marcus. Yeah, you're, you're doing great. <laughs> I've studied drama, you know. Well, you are a princess, so I guess when you inherit the throne, you'd be a drama queen. hi -oh! Okay, guys. Let's keep going. Ron's still watching after all. So let's stop and salute each other mid-play. That won't raise suspicion. Oh, Marcus, I've missed you so. I wish I had never left thy side. Prithee, be careful. Lead me from this place. Oh, that was, uh... <laughs> that was Cornelia. Never mind, sorry about that. See, King Leo, thou shouldst give them thy blessings. Never. Never live, leave his side, thou sayest. Foolish banter, I'll not allow it. Cornelia shall not marry none other than this man, Prince Snyder. Is that not so, Prince Snyder? M marry the princess? Me? I'm like double her age, that's not weird at all. I and this treacherous crew, I will put to death. Well, at least they get one shot at out of combat as well. Pray, sweet child. Come home to the castle with me. Nay, father, I shan't return. Cornelia, trouble me no more. This wedding is for thine own welfare. Be mindful of that. Not if I can help it. I, not if I can help it. Now in my moment of vengeance, for my parents and for my love, Cornelia... I shall cut thee down. No! Cornelia! <laughs> I fucking love Steiner. Ma, kiss, please forgive me. I still love my father. Prithee, be careful. Forgive my selfishness, father, and spare my sweet Marcus. So <laughs> Don just like, oh, Jesus Christ. What have I done? Am I never to hear her loving voice again? Am I cursed never again to feel her soft touch? Oh, cruel fate! 
Thus has robbed me of all I treasure. This brings a tear to my eye. Oh my! This year's so splendid! Wah! Why did she have to die? Why? Now where could that garnet be? Look at the jiggle physics on her. Good lord. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Wow, what a show. Yeah, so sad. I'm glad we climbed all the way over here. How about you, huh? Oh, look out! Oh yeah, those are the knights we found before. Fool, I'm out of here! One, one of the knights is like, FURY! Forgive me. Princess! Leave me alone. Don't come any closer. I'll burn this whole building down. That's actually good reflexes for probably very flammable cotton robe. Zidane, it's time. Princess Garnet, let's get out of here. Wh what? What is going on? Steiner, don't follow me anymore. Captain, sir, we await your orders, sir. Hmm, well, um... Princess, I'm afraid I cannot comply. Stubborn as always, aren't you? Come on, Princess, let's ditch Sir Russell and get out of here. Is Sir mix -a -Lot still a thing? Princess, wait! Hey, kid, you okay? Y yeah I just tripped, that's all. Princess, I can't allow you to go. Seize them at once! Or another fight against Steiner. Uh, this time we aren't actually able to steal from him because we're on stage. And because we're on stage, Marcus and Zadan's secondary skills, which is stale, aren't active. In fact, they're replaced with uh, the special effect. But we have Vivi in the party now, and he's gonna burn everyone to death. Now, Garnet, she has summon, and she has all these lovely summons that we won't be able to use for quite a while. Instead, I'm just gonna have her heal everyone. Now, the two generic Pluto Knights, who do have names, uh, they get one-shotted by the fire. Just have Marcus and Zadon attack and we should be good to go. I'll go over focus a little bit later. It's the same as it has been in other games. It doubles your magic power. You missed? You missed? You're not supposed to miss. I mean, it doesn't matter. He's dead now. Well, I'm gonna say dead. Bah, only a flesh wound. Get over here and I'll gnaw your ankles off. Stabilizer configured. Good. Engine room is good to go. All right. Salute again for some reason. We're moving out. Roger that. Roger, roger. Hey, girl. What's up? There is... Something about the, the, the base, or whatever it's called on the ship, to have a, a mermaid on it, isn't there? I forget the, like, the meaning behind having, like, a woman on the front of your ship. I don't, I think, is it supposed to, like, deter bad luck? I don't know why I'm talking about that during a cutscene, but... Anyways. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, she's so ugly. Not very brighter than the firing at the princess, though, you would imagine, right? Like, oh no, the princess is being captured. How do we stop her from being kidnapped? Shoot harpoons at her. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure if you saw that in the background, but Steiner was trying to climb up to Zidane and uh, Garnett and Vivi rolled into him by accident. That is such a cool looking bomb. That was a weird transition effect. I don't think I've noticed that before. 
So yeah, this is, well, another encounter with Steiner. Uh, we cannot target the bomb in the background. In fact, this is just kind of a scripted battle, so... I mean, it doesn't really matter what you do, just kind of keep attacking Steiner. Uh, even with Vivi's magic, you can't attack a bomb. After a few turns, or I think I think it's based off turns, uh, we'll advance the story. Hey, look behind you! I'll not fall for such an old trick! I mean, if anyone gets low, just kind of heal them with uh, Garnet. You could defend. I don't think that, I don't think Stein will ever actually attack Garnet, but you know, might as well keep everyone healed up, I guess. Six, six isn't a bad cost. I think I just healed herself, anyways. I just focus. Probably one more grow on the bomb, and it will uh, do its deed. Man, that's a pretty good heal for early on. There were 300. Also, do his deed. I just realized I said it. I just processed in my head. Do his deed. Yeah, the bomb's going to crap all over Steiner. Yeah, okay, Kronos. It's a bomb. Oh, somebody set us up the bomb. That's that's an old meme. It's going to blow. It, is it now? Okay. I'm like, yep. Yeah, what are we doing? It probably has its own ATB gauge that it needs to fill up, and it's just slower to make it seem like there's going to be more of an impact. I mean, I'm... clearly there was an impact with that. Like, haha, I prevented you from killing my, uh, kidnapping my daughter by killing her. Oh, thank God, the mermaid's okay. Like, I get aiming for the engines with a harpoon, but they were, like, aiming for where Garnett was. That's not bright. I mean, it did its it did its job. And those poor bastards in those house probably are not having a good day. I like the subtleties they add sometimes. Oh, oof. don't break the fan. That was a priceless heirloom to the family, probably. I don't know. I'm just making that up. But the little details they add, like on the ship, you saw from the distance, you could see Steiner trying to get up, but since he was just blown up by a bomb, he falls to the ground. And there's Baku in the window. We're gonna crash. <laughs> One of those clamp guys just fell. This game is pretty visually appealing. Even back in the day, I mean, this is beautiful stuff. They could still be alive. Garnet! I never would imagine you would do such a thing. Perhaps you're not such a helpless little girl anymore. Thorn! Thorn! Is our little experiment ready? Yes, your majesty. It is combat ready. Easily terminate Princess Garnet. It can, your majesty. I need her alive! Even though I just tried to harpoon her and blow her up, but I need her alive! Bring her back here at once! See, that's what I was saying. They want her alive, but they could have easily just killed her three different ways. This scene kind of transitioned a little better than the one from the city. Kind of looks like that is something out of a horror movie, doesn't it? Oh, my back's killing me. Are you all right? Yeah, but the Prima Vista is wasted. Just our luck to crash in this forest. It's gonna get interesting. What do you mean, interesting, boss? I hear no one's ever made it out of here alive. Said the person that made it out of here alive. Boss, there's fire everywhere. It's out of control. Quit your whining and get it under control. And get the wounded out of here. All right. Get our goods out of here too. Weapons, items, everything we can use. There's no way we can survive if all our stuff is toast. Ew, I'm beat. 
Hurry up and put out the fire. I can't carry them all my, by myself. <laughs> oh. What the hell are you doing? The whole ship's gonna burn up. They're looking for Garnett. Can't find her anywhere. Maybe she fell off, got squished under the ship. This is great. First we kidnap her, then we kill her. We'll hang for sure. How's it done? How's it going? So done! I'm surprised you made it. I can't believe you jumped off. You're nuts, you know that? I didn't jump off. I got thrown off from the impact. So is everyone okay? Yeah. We all get the devil's luck. But if you don't find Princess Garnett, we'll be all dead meat. Active time event. AT Kapoo. Active time event is a system that lets you see other events that are happening at the same time elsewhere, Kapoo. Plus, press the select button when you see that icon flashing below, Kapoo. You can press the button anytime while the icon is flashing. Try pressing the select button, Kapoo. The Forest Keeper. Now, for the most part, we'll be able to see most, if not all, of the AT. There are some that are a little tricky to do if you watch other ones. I think they're actually, now that I mentioned, I think there are some that you just can't see if you watch other ones. It was, is it still coming? Nah, I think we lost it. Watch out! Huh, well, looks like their lives are in danger. That's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you head over to my video section, check out some of my other content, and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. Hope we all have a great day.